This is um, a shipment of the DX Engineering 8040-1 antenna. Came in the UPS today. Uh, see, I placed the order on Monday morning, and uh, I have it already here by noon on Wednesday. So it was um, quite a testament to DX Engineering. They really get their orders out quickly. And it came by UPS ground. And uh, one of the boxes got banged up a little bit, but I'm hoping that when I look inside it'll be a metal part, maybe the winch or something like this that won't uh, really matter. So we'll take it apart and see what uh, what's inside. Okay, here we are with everything out of the box. Um, you can see uh, it came in several four boxes actually. And it came with a lifetime supply of bubble wrap. <laughs> it was packed quite well. And uh, all of the components, uh, nuts and bolts and washers and hardware are in little shrink wrap, or not shrink wrap, but uh, heat sealed pouches. So it's uh, nicely organized. And uh, so the long box contains the element telescoping uh, um, tubes that will make up the vertical, starting out with a 3 inch diameter at the base and going up to 1 inch diameter at the top. And um, there's also a fiber glass or graphite, some kind of composite uh, material, um, half an I-beam channel that is used to support it and insulate it from the ground. Then in the shorter box there was the loading coil and the trap, the loading coil at the base, and the appropriate hardware for it. And then the trap is um, quite substantial, and this sits um, midway up the, uh, up the antenna. A tubular capacitor and a uh, coil inductor that are tunable. And um, <clears throat> then we also purchased the uh, radial plate, as you can see, and uh, one additional set of uh, hardware. We plan to put 60 um, some radials on it, so we'll be doubling up some of the uh, nuts and bolts with um, uh, two wires per bolt. And uh, we also have some um, penetrox, which is used uh, for the aluminum to aluminum and copper to aluminum joints. And also some anti-seizing compound. There's a small lightning arrester surge protector, a uh, choke that will mount at the base to um, help isolate the antenna from the feed line, the appropriate hardware, I think some eyelets and so on, and um, then over here is the winch. This is the um, manual winch, which is a, an add-on, and um, you can see the strap that it uses and the hardware that is nicely organized and the appropriate uh, clamps and bolts. So looking forward to uh, putting it together. Got to get a hole dug and uh, uh, prepare the site and then we'll get the hardware ready for um, assembly and, and installation.